In this 90 second knowledge video, we're going to take a look at website hierarchies. Thanks for your support so far. If you find these videos helpful, you can always subscribe and hit the alerts button too to get our latest video straight away. Hey, so we're taking a look at website hierarchies, but what are they and what do they do? Well, this is another way of talking about the structure of your website and the way that you separate sections of your website into logical subject areas. Website structures are based in information architecture and relate to how you're going to organize the content in your website, whether that's product, written content, or something else. There are effectively three types of website structure, flat, pyramid, and hybrid. And while there's no right or wrong website structure, the essential thing to remember is to keep your structure consistent. So let's get 90 seconds on the clock and take a look at website structures. A flat website structure is one where all the pages exist under very few subdirectories. Think of it like a racing car, low to the ground. For example, the home page, then one, maybe two directory steps followed by the final page. This is often used in e-commerce where a retailer has a very large product catalog it helps search engines to discover product pages and share search equity across those pages. A tiered website hierarchy makes use of folders, also called directories, to divide website pages into very specific category groups. This is more like a race truck with lots of layers, each with a specific purpose. This type of structure tends to be used by content websites or brands which don't sell online, as it helps search engines understand the topics within a website. Finally, you can use a hybrid model, which tends to be used by businesses selling online, but with relatively few products. The tiered structure helps to build an understanding of website sections, but with products placed in a high level category, so equity is spread between pages easily. This is like a race circuit, allowing the race car to do its job, but with all the infrastructure and support to function the race truck properly. There's no right or wrong website structure to use. What's important to remember is consistency. If you add pages and sections in a certain way, use this approach everywhere, so users and search engines understand how to navigate between the sections of your site. If you're building a new website, think about how you might want your structure to work before going live. Internal linking is also really important. Features such as breadcrumbs or links in body content help users and search engines to navigate and you can check out our previous video on how to add internal links if you like. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like, subscribe and share. Plus, join us again soon for more practical digital marketing advice to help your business.